I'm sick and f***ing tired of people using this as a tool to try to get rhythm shooting abolished. Like, this is why you don't... <laughs> this is why you don't add rhythm shooting, man. Shut the f*** up, man. Hey, guys, it's LJ. Make sure you like the video and subscribe for more great content from my daddy. Good afternoon, that damn 2K lab. Man, check this out, man. So it all started with this post right here, bro, where my man was like, yo, you got the paddles, you got the power, man. And you know what I'm saying? I think he was really gassing the paddles and stuff like that. Cause you know, people don't, yeah, a lot of people don't understand how it actually works and how stuff goes with this game and stuff like that. But don't worry because I am going to clarify all of it for y'all in one second, man. And we're going to get right to the bottom of it. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video and comment down, thoughts down below. What, what do y'all think about the paddles and stuff, man? Y'all think it's cheating? Y'all think it's not? It is what it is, man. But I'm going to show y'all what we're going with this thing. To the moon, Alice! Hey, and if nobody told y'all this today, y'all, my brothers, my sisters, my family, love each and every last one of y'all. Hey, money on the floor. Let's get straight to it, man. So listen, um, the whole thing with the paddles is this. A lot of people were talking about in the comment section it's not cheating because you're just remapping the button. So, cheating or not, it's something that's given is, is giving you an unintended effect, right? Uh, the whole issue with it is, but actually, let's let's listen to him talk about the video and all that first, and then once we do that, we will uh, we'll we'll address everything and go from there. My uh, I give y'all my whole opinion and everything. Let's get it. Paddles on the back, no X button, no stick, nothing. Watch. Screen. Bro, I'm not even shooting with the X button, bro. I'm shooting with paddles. <laughs> this only works on Xbox right now. Go down to Xbox accessories, go to your profile, and then go to configure controller. Go down to your bottom right trigger and set that to your right stick down. Just click A on it, go down about halfway on the options menu, bro, and you're gonna find it. It's easy money. I really can't believe 2K has no way to patch this. This is why you don't add rhythm shooting in the 2K. Now, as soon as you set that the right stick down, go over to your. I'm sick and f***ing tired of people using this as a tool to try to get rhythm shooting abolished. Like, this is why you don't... <laughs> this is why you don't add rhythm shooting, man. Shut the f*** up, man. It don't got nothing to do with that. And I'm, I'm, I'm going to show y'all some more. Other, like, hold on, my bad, my bad. Like, hard. Let me do a hard eight style. Shut the f*** up. Shut the f*** up. Like, why do, why do we always want to blame the tool instead of the craftsman on certain things? Like, like the commute like it's in the game and it's like that 2k does have the ability to change it but we, again we're gonna we're gonna talk about that in a second man it's just crazy that people that's what the real that is what the real issue is and the real uh agenda is here people want to get rhythm shooting abolished and they will do anything that they can they want to get rhythm shooting abolished so that they can so the 2k will be like okay everybody now everybody will be complaining saying that there is no tool for us to shoot more consistently and then now that everybody complains then 2k will probably have no choice but to make it more consistent bro we hitting with the x button man bro not that shooting four out of five with the x button it is what it is man man grind the fuck hard shooting five out of six with the x button uh t mizzle instant bro, bro everybody's shooting the ball Bree, everybody's hitting so i don't get it man but anyway let's continue your left trigger man the bottom left trigger gonna do the same exact thing just do it for up the time it takes for your controller to register the two button presses man i'm telling you it's green every time you don't even have to even try I mean, you gotta try a little bit bro but it takes minimal effort don't blame this on me man i'm just the one with the xbox controller that figured this out make sure you send this to your homie who's struggling to shoot bro because i'm sure he'd love to hear it or he might even go out and get him an xbox controller himself or buy one because i tell you what xbox is better bro send this to your homie you need to shoot better paddles on the back no x let's button no stick nothing watch oh it started back over man so anyway let's see what people are saying about it down in the comment section man said so why does it need to be why does it need to be patched blame 2k for the idea this isn't a, this isn't a terrible idea uh like bash regression or quick draw <laughs> <laughs> or overall fluctuation it's not the best idea but it doesn't need to be patched i agree with that uh shooting shooting should have never been changed and i don't even use an xbox controller man he said hey you can do this with the with the dual sense edge on uh playstation this is what people are saying you can do it on that current gen next gen all that good stuff man uh paddles paddle shift shooting been the meta that's what one dude said man he said hey been doing this since the xbox xbox elite controller came out lmao uh let me see what people do to win is insane man so i just don't understand why why would anyone want to do this 
what is the point of play, playing the game if you're going to automatically green every shot? The thing is, you're not going to automatically green every shot. The whole point and the whole thing with rhythm shooting is this. This is why people are doing it, but this is why it's something that's unfair. I'm shooting on, I'm trying to do it on my other screen. I don't know how much the delay is gonna be with me doing this, so I'm probably gonna miss every shot, but this is what it is. Okay, the core of it is this. With rhythm shooting, you have to pull, you pull, the, you come off everything, pull the, pull the stick down. When he gets it to the set point, you go up at a certain, at a certain speed. Now, I don't know how I just hit that slow. It's probably because the game know that they screwed me or something like that. Um, but uh, I'm like I said, I'm shooting from my Elgato, so I'm probably gonna miss a lot of these. You see, that said late, but um, yeah, I'm, I'm really I can't I can't do it because I'm not doing it live. But at any rate, dang, maybe I can do it off my uh, off this screen over here. Yeah, I, I can't even do it off of that screen, bro. Uh, I would have to be. Let me change it to my. Let me flip this over real quick. Hopefully, it don't mess up everything that I got going on. Uh, I had to change it to my Xbox. But anyway, you go down and you go up at the rate that that you're supposed to go up bro i am not hold on why why i gotta see why this is working though because i'm on uh what them whites is going in and i think that that's gonna add further validity to to what's actually happening uh what's my shooting what's my shooting on controller settings yeah pro stick only set point real player percentage timing out where my high risk at yeah high risk high reward i don't know how to, how that's working with high risk high reward but that adds further literally what i'm about to say bro it's in like i've not seen anybody use this in competition or anything like that and i've not seen anybody hit hit crazy shots the thing of it is from back here if you take shots that are slightly you got to be on the line because do you see how the timing is changing for shots that are slightly outside my range and stuff like i have to know this timing back here now it might you might could get it to work for stuff like this right here you know shots that you that are going to be the same you know your mid ranges and all of that but it's not an auto green because you're going to have to hit one paddle to to start the shot and then you you hit a you know you you come off the paddle and then at the release point and then you hit the other paddle the issue is and the part that that people perceive to be cheating or what have you is the fact that it times the second uh paddle for you but you see where he was standing when he was shooting that. He wasn't back here. To hit these shots, like, I don't even know if a button shooter could hit these shots, but bro, it is in like the, the the timing changes so much on the shots. The further you get back, like right on these shots right here, some of the shots, contested shots and stuff. I just have to know the timing. You gotta know both timers. You have to know the timing for the uh for the shot stick, you know, for the for the set point. And you also have to know the timing for the, um, and we're done with that. You also have to know the timing for the, the, the rate at which you need to push the stick forward. And so that part is, is what I think, um, if there was a cheating component to it, I think that part would be where the cheating would be is that it times the, it times the, uh, tempo for you. You don't have to time tempo. You, you, you do have to time the set point but you don't have to time tempo and it'll probably be a lot easier to time the set point just because of the fact that it's going to be 70 percent more but i promise you time and tempo that fluctuate is fluctuates as well if you're wide open it's going to change if you're contested it's going to change light pressure is going to change the, the the further from the rim you are is going to change the closer to the rim you are is going to change all that those are things like i said you just have to know these things and i think right there you see how you see what i said right there very tight i got a slightly fast right and um but at the same time let's go back here i got shots that i like i put up i put up from here bro this shot right here i promise you you're not hitting this one right here with with the um with the paddles and think it's gonna be an auto green right here where where you get contested or whatever like like it's just not about to happen this light pressure shot right here you just got i just have to know that timing so if somebody wants to use the paddle i i i incur go ahead and try to do it but i promise you you're gonna your experiences may vary and uh i don't think you're gonna have the experience that you're thinking that you're gonna have where it's just gonna be auto green after auto green or what have you because it's just, it's, it's, it's not as easy as it looks, man. Going on to see what Hank the Tank said about it, man. He said, hey, bring back shooting with the square. What in the world? Uh, Xbox now 
has a competitive advantage over PlayStation because they can remap their paddles to the right stick for rhythm shooting. There is no reason to be to not be on Xbox 2K did too much with the rhythm shooting uh, and it's back and it backfired. And like I said, we just know that Hank wants to uh, Hank just want to want it to be back how it was or whatever like that, man. And, and the shooting to be back how it was because like like him and grinding the other week, like what are we saying? You got a competitive advantage or whatever, but he and grinding last week, they were just saying this right here. I genuinely don't, I genuinely wouldn't care if Zens were a problem, if it means that I get consistent shooting time and across all shots. So is that what y'all really want? You just want, let's say, let the let the thousand weirdos live in the, living in their parent basements beat me, I don't care. And then, hey, like we said, shoot, then he came back the next day and clarified what he said. And the first person known that saying is, hey, hanky tanky, them 2K casuals, the most toxic, evil hearted people ever. And then this was when was saying, hey, I just, I swear the 2K community just wakes up angry every day. Just to clarify, I don't, I don't, I do not want shooting buff. Um, if I go to, I mean, if you know, blah, blah, blah. If you know, you know, I'm shooting over 55%, blah, 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 700 games, all that good stuff, man. Say, I don't, I don't even necessarily want to change it. I'm just voicing my opinion on a very specific gameplay aspect where random, random animations can affect the speed of your jump shot instead of control variable like stamina loss or uh, stamina loss, for example. Back to the grind, love y'all. That's what he was saying. So he wants it to be, you know, everything to be more consistent. It's just like kind of like what Sid was saying, though, man. If you pay attention to everything that's going on, you can you can actually tell what's going on uh, with your shot, how your shot is gonna be, what you need, how you need the timing, and all of that. And I think you can get it right. It's just that you can't you can't just just have a timing in your head anymore and just shoot it. And I feel like it never should have been that way. Or they could have just gone back to how it was in 2K23. Where in 2K23 or uh, in 2K22, uh, was it 2K23 and 2K? Anyway, the, you, you had different times in 23, but in 21 and 22, I think it was where you were on the floor dictated what your timing was on that shot. So if you wanted to use a Zen in, in 21 and 22, you had to sit back, you know, you had to, you had to be in one spot and set it for that one spot here. I mean, I don't even see it being an issue, man. Like I said, a lot of people just, if you want to use this, if you don't, if you don't want to use rhythm shooting, don't use rhythm shooting, but please don't, don't use the, the people using the paddles as an excuse to want to try to get it abolished so you can seek easier shooting so people can use their Zens or what. I, I don't know, man. I think people low-key want to use Zens and stuff, but I just feel like it's not even a big deal. And even Yardman agrees with me, man. Yardman says, man, I'm a PS user here. I rhythm shoot 95% of my shots off the dribble. It's, it doesn't affect me. I'll still shoot, shoot better than most paddle users. I'm defending Xbox, uh, not 2K. I don't know. I don't want you to, I don't know how you can misinterpret that. And so this is what he was showing right here. He like, he shoot all his stuff off the dribble and I do the same. I mean, not off the dribble, but he uses uh, rhythm shooting to do, to do all of his stuff. And uh, hold on, let me make sure I get that because I can't be getting no copyright yard mine. But yo, all he's saying is, I feel the same way. I don't care, I'm a rhythm shooter. I know if like we, because, because he's a rhythm shooter, he understands exactly what I'm saying. You have to make changes, small micro changes, depending on what it is that you're doing or where you are on the floor, what type of shots you taking, where you semi open, wide open, all of that. You have to know these things. That paddle is not gonna know that. So it's just like what I'm gonna show y'all a video in a second when my man is saying what y'all are trying to do. You're trying to simulate analog movement with a button. It's never gonna be as good. The fact that it even works in the first place is insane to me. Like, like at what speed is it moving? And it's a really easy fix for uh, 2K. All they got to do is find what that constant speed that the paddle is moving at and just make none of those beat and make none of the shots be at that speed. It's really, really easy to be able to do it. But because it changes every time, like I said, I don't see it as an issue. And like we said, we see Yard Mind mixing it up and he's shooting. And like I said, that one was slightly open. So that shot is going to be a little bit faster. And these, like I said, you just got to know that the paddle is not going to know that. Um, it's not gonna know that. It's just not gonna know it. And then my man said, "This is uh, this is uh, one one more time we got him saying. He say blame two K for putting rhythm shooting in the game. PS uh, pro controllers have always given an advantage. That's why they cost a uh, buck fifty to two hundred. They say two K should have done homework before adding rhythm shooting. And he said the person who got it who got it uh through probably got st got stock on the investment. <laughs> Well, bro, stop, so I say, stop it, man. Listen, man, the whole point is then my man came back and he says, hey, I'm a PS user and I don't care. I don't care. They just, uh, I don't care. Just get better, dude. Hey, I just shot 15 for 20 from the wreck in three in a game with rhythm. And, uh, 
and it's not a big deal having a handful of people doing this exactly bro i, I really don't care um is it's, it's rhythm shooting really op uh i still use square and i agree with what my man said he said i still use square i just shot five for five exactly brute use square and he's and you know what i'm saying he shot five for five five for six i don't think it is op i think i'm just more comfortable shooting shots off of the rhythm because i feel like i have more control like that's that's the reason that i do it but you know a lot of other people they 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 probably feel like it i do it because it gives me an advantage at first i felt like i had two chances to miss so i wouldn't use it and then i stuck at it and i was like nah i feel like i got way more control when i'm rhythm shooting if somebody's bearing down on me i know how to shoot it if somebody if i'm wide open i know how to shoot it and it's just like i know i know i can get this right i just feel like i can get it right more than pressing the button but that's just how i feel that's not necessarily that's that is the case or anything like that it's just uh it's it's just how it goes man up next we got and then uh, my boy tj he said hey ps not at a competitive disadvantage if y'all if y'all could do that paddle stuff which they can because all they're gonna do bro just about everybody got a playstation got an xbox all they're gonna do all they're going to do is go buy an xbox controller an elite controller and they're gonna share play it or they already got an elite controller they have something like that already and they're gonna share player they're gonna use they're gonna plug that zen up or they're gonna do it i promise you people have already tried it and i promise you like we're not hearing about zens or people doing it to a certain point for a reason because it just doesn't work all across the board like people think it would but anyway uh he said it's not a competitive event if y'all could do that paddle stuff y'all would uh you should take uh take this stuff let me see you would take that stuff off and still not use it to be honest yeah that's what i would do it's not crazy it's not a crazy uh not that crazy of a difference and you still have to time it also and so like i said again you do have to still time it but the glitch of it is that it times rhythm for you which a lot of times is the most difficult part but who's if you're a person that that's so to a person that doesn't shoot uh it's not a rhythm shooter you're probably gonna feel like, dang, man, that's crazy. They're gonna get an advantage. A person that is a rhythm shooter is just gonna be like, I mean, it's just not, there's no way that it can be as consistent as I can because I can make the changes and the paddle cannot make the changes uh, for me. Say, hey, paddle's still easier to use in the stick regardless of if you're gonna time it or not. There's a script out, out there uh you don't gotta time it for how's that not an advantage but it's not the paddles that's the zen scripts are scripts are advantages yes but just just being on uh being done with paddles you have to have an advantage the script doesn't have see that's what i'm saying this is misinformation right here uh like this that's, that's one of my favorite uh favorite chicks in the world is misinformation and um and it's, uh, and apparently that's the internet's number one chick is misinformation because if you're using a script that means you have a zen which means there's no need to use the paddles do you understand what I'm saying? Or the paddles, the script is written. So you have you have an ancillary uh, thing there. And if you're using a Zen, you can certainly program your paddles to to do whatever you want to do and, and, and emulate anything. You can you can emulate your whole your whole gesture on the shot and stuff like that. So that's something that's just totally wild. And you can do that on Xbox, PlayStation, whatever. And you know, like I said, y'all gonna share play it anyway and do it like y'all was doing it last year on PlayStation and then claim it was just Xbox, which really make y'all some bitch ass niggas. But hey, it is what it is. Hey, Car hey Cardi says, hey, y'all gassing the paddle, paddle, paddle rhythm shooting uh, in 2K25 is crazy. Saying this is in 2.0, that stuff is, is terrible. Uh, the stick is way better, exactly. And he says, uh, with that being said, bring back zero R rng is shooting no matter what you use is stick or the button zero rng hey man I, I don't know if they ever gonna bring back zero rng because of what we got last year and people still were able to figure it out man and do stuff but hey it is what it is that boy that black cobra got off the train he just said mission aborted while i enjoy the benefits and have learned to shoot a variety of different shots with it like i said you have to learn to shoot a variety of different shots with it uh it's not natural to me and i don't need any more stick drift i'll uh i'll accept the penalty for using the button hey man like i said if it's not for you it's not for you it, it's all good i think it's uh i think it's it's cool man but my man right here hey he got something for y'all though he said y'all worried about the wrong thing man i'm just gonna let him talk i'm gonna let him talk talk to them boys me go fish now everybody right, let's, let's bag fish. it up let's bag it up here we go now everybody talking about this shooting with the panels and shit like that on 2k i mean but he just comprehend shoot. this about this Baltimore. shooting yep he definitely with Baltimore. the panels and shit like that Baltimore. on 2k i mean but just comprehend this right you are trying to mimic analog movement on a button exactly 
comprehend that for a second. Now, this build right here, this build don't even shoot. He got 25 three ball, 25 mini. He don't shoot. So I'm not about to show y'all what shooting is like. I'm show y'all. Let me just cut to the motherfucking chase. Mm. Dunk me, the nigga. Right. You see it? You see it? Right? He's saying y'all timing. That's y'all worry about the wrong shit. You need to be worried about how they timing this dunk meter with them paddles. Y'all worry about Ain't the wrong shit. nobody saying that though, is it? It's not instant greens anyway. I still got to time this shit, but wait a minute, there's more. Definitely got a time. Aggressive combo, go to shots. He can't shoot. Do all that stuff, Hold man. On. Think of that you can program it on. You put it on the paddle. You Aggressive do all combo. that stuff. These are the stuff. These Regular are the things that they talking about, man. Floater. Flotation device. Not just the standing floater. Hmm. Running floater. He can't. He ain't got no. Shots, Way easier so he to time. You know what I'm saying? I bricked it, of course. You know what I mean? But I'm just trying to show y'all the mechanics so we can go up here. Regular layup. Hey! Oh, you having trouble hitting up on the right stick so you can get that safe dunk? Hey, get on that rim. Right! Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay. We want to okay. shoot out the post? Shoot out the post, getting the same animation. We want to shoot out the post? Time, and you want to get the same animation every time? Every time, though? Same animation every time. Mind every you, the Bill can't shoot. Though. So I'm not going to make none of these. He going to make none of these because he's Same can't animation shoot. every time. Wait. Mm. We talking hook shots? Let's see what them hook shots do. Fades, all that. Fades, fades. I wanna on, live bruh. forever. Wait, here go the. Come on, bruh. Come on, bruh. You can do all that, and we're gonna get right back to it. The dunk meter. Hey, like he said, man, we're gonna get right back to it with the dunk meter. So what he's trying to tell people is if you're too dense or thick to understand what he's saying, he's just saying that the time, so what the analog stick is gonna do is gonna mimic up and down when you put it on a paddle. And even though you can't mimic the motion, so it can't understand that, but things in the game that require it not to mimic the motion, it just needs to be on or off. It is infinitely more valuable to put it on the paddles because it's an instant on or off and it's way more precise timing than when I go from here to here. Like I'm timing a dunk and I go, I go to dunk and then I come off of it. There is some lag time between here and here. So the amount of precision that I can gain from going from here to here, it is trumped by putting it on the paddle, which a lot of people, like I said, you can do that or whatever. Like it, it is what it is, but it doesn't time it for you. So it's not a big deal, but that's what he's saying. He's saying, if you want to use it to, to try to get auto greens that you still got a time, I don't, I think, I don't think it's sufficient for that. I would use it for more precise timing on certain things. And I, I definitely understand what he's trying to say, say with that, man. But like I said, man, like I, I don't want this whole thing to be an indictment on the thing, man. Cause like, you're going to get stuff like this with Devcon. He's saying, Hey, rhythm shots, uh, what he shot, um, he rhythm shooting from, from full court. Now, what he did not show you is the 600 times that he missed to get these four clips. That's what we're saying. Because if uh, <laughs> they say crazy, they, Jesus Christ, he's not showing you the 400 times that he missed to do that. Like I said, he's just showing you the, the, the four times that he hit. So like, like, like if, if, and if, and if it was precise or it was something that he was hitting over and over, he would have done a video instead of just showing you those four four joints where he got the instant greens or whatever. But hey, it is what it is. That's what I think anyway, man. But anyway, uh, last but not least, man, we got my boy Joey Noe. He just asking y'all which bill y'all want to see next, man. I'm weighing in on this. He says, hey, man, which one y'all want to see the 60 to 99 again? Which one is going to be cooler, the Wilt Chamberlain or Michael Jordan? I'm going to say Mike, man. I'm going to tell you why, because everybody, we see Wilt every day. Every, it's going to kind of, like Richard Sherman said, not kind of bland. It's going to kind of blend. He's just country. He's just country as hell like I am. So he says it's, it's kind of blend, but B-L-E-N-D is pronounced bland when you're from the country. Just like B-A-C-K is pronounced bike. I don't care what Bridget Smith says. B A C K is pronounced bike, and B L E N D is pronounced bland. It just is what it is. And just like uh, R U S T Y is resty, it just is what it is. V V I N C E is Vance. His name was Vance Carter. I don't care what nobody's saying, man. It is what it is. O R A N G E spells orange. All right. 
I don't want to hear none of this stuff, man. Y'all boys, if you if you ain't country like I, tell me I'm wrong if y'all ain't from the country like I. Anyway, so we yeah, uh, we everybody gonna be Wilt, man. It's just like Michael. It ain't Mike. M I C H A M I C H A E L. That's Michael Jordan. All right, just like it's Mike Mike Donalds. Mac, it ain't it ain't McDonald's. It's McDonald's. All right, so that's what we going with. We want to see that Michael Jordan vehicle. We didn't see. Well, so everybody will in this game. Everybody can stand up under the rim and pull 19 rebounds or 30 boards and go straight back up with impunity because now what y'all need to be talking about the real player percentage. Like my man said, man, this is what you need to be talking about right right here. What Dime Work is talking about with the real player percentage is, hey, hey it's, it's, I really can't grasp how somebody can feel good about scoring with real player percentage. Do MFs not care about exercising any type of skill? Do y'all just want to play the game and win at any cost? Yes, that's what they want to do. It's not uh, It's not about uh, test uh, testing, honoring, I mean, testing the honing your skills at all. I just don't get it. And that's what we're talking about, man. Like all of his real player percentage, man. Hey, it is what it is, man. I don't see how people, people will come in there and beat you in the wreck. Just pull board after board or do whatever and just go up over you in the proven grounds and all of that with real player percentage on, not timing a damn thing. And uh, they'll, and they'll win the games or whatever. And guess what? You, you can't do nothing but just deal with it, man. But anyway, I done already talked too long. Y'all ain't gonna watch the video anyway. Can y'all give me the 300 likes today? Because I know if you came this far and tell me if, if my pronunciations is rat. All right, R-I-G-H-T. Tell me if they rat. Okay, let me know. I'm gonna holler at y'all next time. Take it easy. Love each and every last one of y'all. Until next time, it's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Town. Gosh,